Do you guys have days where you wake up, you get things done, you do what you have to do, and then you sit down, you look at the clock, and it's already 6 p.m. and the day's pretty much gone? Does that happen to any of you guys? Because it's happening to us today. Oh boy. But good afternoon, my friends. So this video was actually supposed to be uploaded last Sunday, but instead I decided to film and upload my drive and talk video, which by the way, I really appreciate all of the support that you guys left me in that video. It means the world to me. Anyways, this video is going to be more of a day in the life type of vlog where I just take you guys with us and show you what we do when we kind of have the day off. We do some shopping. We have a lot of fun. We make adult decisions on new things that we want to purchase for the house. And then I show you a few cheat codes of mine as far as my health journey. Some delicious snacks that you guys should be looking into. Anyways, it's going to be fun. I hope you guys are ready because we are. Let's go do this. We are back at our favorite store to shop at, Target, because we need a few things, like this chopper Bianca found. Yes, I've been wanting to get this to make it just a little bit easier for the week. That's going to come in handy. Yes. And I did just put this Nespresso machine in our cart because <laughs> we might get it. there's a offer if you are a Target Circle member. It expires 140. today. Yeah. Can you imagine though on Black Friday it goes to like 99? See, that's what I'm worried about <laughs> yeah. is, you know, it's we're about a month away from Black Friday. Look at everything it does. Hot or over ice. We really want this to start taking a shot of espresso before the gym yes. as our pre-workout. Only like five calories. Yeah. Dang, what should we do? This is so hard. <laughs> also, they have our favorite coffee that we like to drink during the holiday season from Starbucks, the holiday blend. We have been here for <laughs> like close to 30 minutes on this aisle debating if we should get the Nespresso machine or not. Because right now we have been using our Keurig, which we've had since what, 2020? Yeah. <laughs> since our first apartment together? It's been a blur. I don't know. What do you guys think? Should we do it or should we wait for Black Friday? I don't know. Oof. Stay tuned. Offer ends today. Yeah, stay tuned. Stay tuned. We just left the gym. <laughs> we looked like a mess. It was leg day. Yes, yeah, sorry. It was a great workout Get though. <laughs> We're now here at Publix and I found what I was looking for. I'm going to try these Fairlife Elite protein shakes because they have 42 grams of protein per bottle. I mean, come on. I'm also in love <laughs> with these mush oats. These were on Shark Tank, I believe. About a year ago. Six grams of protein. I mean, these things are absolutely delicious. All right, we just made it back home and I wanted to do a quick grocery haul because I am very excited about some of these items that we found today, like these Cake Batter Delight Premier Protein Shakes. These have been so hard to find and Publix had one more, so I grabbed it. 30 grams of protein. And then we got the Core Power Elite protein shakes, 42 grams of protein. I mean, come on, can't get better than that. We got some more unsweet vanilla almond milk. We did get the chopper, more butter, my steaks. Of course, the mush oats. I love these things. I got three apple cinnamon, dark chocolate, strawberry, and peanut butter. And then we got some protein bars. Bianca found these, 20 grams of protein. These are birthday flavor birthday cake flavor can't wait to try these and then some vegetables and bianca's final birthday gift just arrived i got her a new pair of shoes these are the nike metcon fives it's a great versatile shoe for weightlifting and cardio also theme parks right <laughs> walking around the oh, theme park oh yeah i can't wait thank you babe of course i like them a lot so comfy I love it. It gives me like a nice little heel in the back. So it's, I feel a little taller. <laughs> I may have to get myself a pair. I like it. They're very good for weight. Yeah, definitely good for like legs and stuff. Also, they're very stable. They're pretty affordable. Yeah. They're not like ultra boost. No. Also, we did decide not to purchase the Nespresso machine because number one, we really did not want a black coffee maker. We really want the cream or the silver. And I just had a gut feeling to wait until Black Friday and or Cyber Monday. I feel like 
either Target, Walmart, Best Buy, Amazon, someone, or even like Sam, someone will have a really good deal. So if you guys see anything worth mentioning as far as deals for a Nespresso machine, come back to this video and leave us a comment. We would really appreciate it. Bianca just made my dinner and it looks amazing. This is two servings of sirloin steak. And then on the food scale, this was about 204 grams, which equals out to be a little over 40 grams of protein. And then my broccoli is six grams of protein. I got my zero sugar Gatorade. And then Bianca also made a green juice. Yeah. Good morning, it's Future Dev. I just tried this Cake Batter Delight Premier Protein Shake. Oh my goodness. This was absolutely delicious. This is the best protein shake I've ever had. And honestly, if things taste this good, it's going to make dieting a lot easier. So you just have to find things that you like and your taste buds like, and I can't recommend this enough. Okay, we are back in the car. We are heading out to Home Goods and Dr. Phillips. We love going out to Dr. Phillips. We don't get to go out there as much as we would like to, but we're out in that area because Bianca wants to start shopping for Christmas decorations because how crazy does that sound? I know. It's not even Halloween and we're talking about Christmas. That's uh, Floridians for you. But um, yeah, we wanna find some new decorations and some new home stuff for the house. And then today is the first day I want to eat something that's not on the diet sheet, if you know what I mean. I think we both agree to Chick-fil-A because that sounds amazing <laughs> right now. I have not had Chick-fil-A in a while. That sounds good, let's do that. And we'll see what else we get into for the rest of the day. Yes. And here we are. I am so dang excited to eat Chick-fil-A. It's been a while. All right, my mouth is watering. Bianca got the spicy deluxe. And then I got the, oh boy, the number seven grilled chicken club sandwich. This is 515 calories, but this has 38 grams of protein, 38 grams. And then I'm cheating today, got some fries. And then for our drinks, we got a diet Sunjoy, which is diet lemonade and unsweet tea. Wow, Chick-fil-A is incredible. Chick-fil-A never misses. It's always so good. And this is like the only place when we do get takeout that we don't have to check the bags because we know our food that we ordered will be in that bag. It never fails, but it was super fresh today. By the way, we were talking about 90 Day Fiance, the last resort on TLC and what, HBO Max? Mm -hmm. If you guys know that show, you guys know how <laughs> great that last episode was and how wild that episode was. We watched it last night and can't stop talking about it. If you wow. know, you know. If you know, you know. <laughs> Big Ed. <laughs> Next up, we are here at Home Goods. I have never been to this location. Bianca has because sometimes she'll drop me off at Universal, which is just right over there. Well, I go film. And then I wanted to point out here in Dr. Phillips is a really great area to live here in Central Florida. However, it is expensive. Made it inside. They have plenty of Christmas merchandise. Can't believe it. <laughs> Christmas is pretty much already here and <laughs> Halloween is what? Two weeks away, yeah, if that? Less than that. My goodness, it's coming. But I'm gonna let Bianca take over and see what she can find here. As we walk in, we have like a wall of angels and Santas and elves and snowmen. So cute. I've always wanted to do a Candyland type of Christmas theme and right here, all this pink, it's just shouting at me. So cute. Oh, this is adorable. What are you looking at, babe? I found this little sled full of presents for the outside. Oh, how cute. I like that a lot. And then adorable. I love the polar our... bear. Oh, how cute. And then also to go with our Candy land. Oh my goodness. Now this is adorable, babe. If we would have gotten married this year, this could have been a purchase. I know. Well, <laughs> Maybe next year? 2024. Oh, I like the bill too. <laughs> oh my goodness. I see what you're doing, Miss. <laughs> I see the trend. Of oh, candy. he's cute. How much is he? What does it say? Oh, $12.99. <laughs> it's going in the cart. You know what I would like to do this year? Yeah. I don't like a Christmas village. 
Oh, that's my that one That takes request. time though. I feel like that takes years. You buy like one every year. True. Once True. it's established, like a little town. Oh, look at the gingerbread. Oh, how cute. Home Goods has the best Christmas decor. Is this like a pillow? Well, that's cute. Oh, for like stockings. I'm so excited for Christmas. That is adorable. These cute black reindeers. Very modern. Perfect for like a dining room table. I found this nativity scene. This is so adorable. I've never seen something like this here at Home Goods. Yeah. $24.99. I like it. Like below the tree, right? Yeah. Cute little baby Jesus. Okay, I think Dev, you have an obsession of like tacky Santas. Well, because we live in Florida. Yeah, no, no, no. I know. You know, you know how Floridians are. We're, it's like novelty. We go crazy for holidays, but there's a mermaid Santa mermaid, Santa. King Triton. Yeah. All right, so they have like all colors here. We have red, gold, silver, and silver is so nostalgic to me because that's like my childhood. My mom always decorated in silver or gold. And then we just have kind of like a neutral color, which I really like too. I am still obsessing over these black reindeers. They're so cute. But where would we put them? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, we'd have to Are figure that out. Or? Yeah. But if anyone's interested, this is what Home Goods has right now. This is mid October, and this is what we're seeing. This is adorable. These little mushroom pieces. I love that. I'm just seeing this vase right next to the mushrooms. And is this like the trend now? I'm seeing this all over social media, these type of glassware and vases. So beautiful. Seeing some more decor here, some garland made from ornaments, some berries. What? They have Joffrey's here, the Harvest Blend. Wow. A lot more affordable. <laughs> I was just going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> if you're into baking, they have Peppermint Crunch, Christmas Sprinkles. Ooh, we got hot chocolate on a stick. Okay. What an adorable serving tray. And it spins. I've been looking for a ice bucket for the office. That's perfect. For the Bourbon Lounge for a while. I think I just found one. It's very clean, <laughs> sweet. How much? $16.99. What? That's not bad. Did you just find something? Yeah, I've been looking for something like this. And That's it's the awesome. Wood finish yes. That I like for the office to match everything <laughs> else. I love that. Getting this Good too. find, babe. Hey, Hitting I've the never jackpot. been to this one. Dr. Phillips Home Goods. If you're in the Central Florida area, come to this one. Yeah, it's very calm too. Did I just give a secret <laughs> away? All right. I'm seeing more Santas for outside maybe? No, I wouldn't put these outside. Oh, now that is adorable. Does it light up? I think it does. Oh, how cute. Very beautiful. This polar bear, how cute. To my left, I'm walking over to some more glassware. Christmas themed, how cute. Oh, look at these glasses. How beautiful the pattern. I think they're $3.99. Oh, look. Oh, how cute. Did you find something, babe? Yeah. <gasps> no. I have like a full bar. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this is awesome. Okay. How much is it? Uh, oh, a thousand dollars. Ah, it's not bad though. This not is nice. The storage on this side. Wow. Oh I wish it was my. more rustic looking, but oh this home goods has like an entire bar, I know, lounge I do. area. Seeing okay. some more Christmas. How cute is all of this? Is this like a sleigh bathtub? <laughs> I love the Christmas tree trays. That's adorable. Okay, Home Goods. Find anything else? I mean, I found this ice bucket. Oh, that's nice. Very nice. It comes with a scoop. Oh, I like it. It's a little more expensive. It's 40. More my vibe. Yeah. But the other one didn't come with like a scoop no. or. And then, yeah. I'm not really Star into Wars? wine at all. <laughs> Uh-oh. But look at this. Oh, that's cool. So I can store my wine if I was to drink wine. But <laughs> yeah, we don't drink wine. I'm more of a collector. Home Goods has you covered here with the gift bags, foil paper, wrapping paper, 
We've got some tree skirts. How adorable. Again with the Florida seashell pattern. Love that. Coming over to the candle section. How cute. Love that. Some Christmas tree candles. Did we just find some holiday pillows? Yes, we're in the pillow section and this is so cozy. Love we it. do need more <laughs> decorative holiday pillows. Yeah, we do. Is that the only one? Probably, so I don't know if I'm gonna get this particular one, but they do have a lot and I wanna show you guys the selection. I had to put the bar sign back because the bee was wobbly. Oh no. I'm gonna find another one. Darn it. <laughs> this is what we're looking at here as far as the pillows and blankets. Some pillows. All right. They still have some Halloween blankets and pillows. Love that. There's Dev. <laughs> Just perusing home goods with me. <laughs> <laughs> well, we found a few things. Didn't really find too much, but we're going to continue to go to home goods and see what of we can course. find. <laughs> you guys will see what we get once we start decorating for Christmas, yes. which is not that far away at all. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> All right, my friends, I think that's going to do it for today's video. Just to be transparent, some of this video was filmed today and some of it was filmed last week. I just put it all together and that's what I created out of this day in the life type of vlog today. But we did go check out Moana Journey of Water finally this morning. It was fun. I have a lot of thoughts on the walkthrough attraction. I want to go back sometime during the evening that way i can have footage from both during the day and during the nighttime i feel like nighttime is going to look and feel a lot better than during the day but yeah be looking for a review and an honest opinion video coming soon from wana journey of water but thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today we did shopping. We're still debating on the Nespresso machine. Like I said, I'm keeping my options open until Black Friday and or Cyber Monday. I'm sure we'll find something then. I just can't believe it's the end of the year. Halloween is happening and then we have Thanksgiving. Well, really not that because right after Halloween here in Orlando, as a theme park enthusiast, we hop right into Christmas. So <laughs> you guys will be seeing Christmas videos here in a few weeks and then we have Thanksgiving and then we have Christmas and New Year's. We're very excited. We have some stuff coming up, some travel plans and cannot wait to share those with you. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, please go ahead and give it a big thumbs up as it really does help out the channel in so many different ways. I love you guys so much. Please remember, it's nice to be nice in YouTube. I'll see you in the next video. I'm out.